Hey guys, what's up? This is your boy Manu. Welcome back to the channel. And today we are going to talk about how I transformed the lighting of this room from this to this. Oh shit, I forgot. You. If you are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe and click that bell notification icon so whenever I upload, you get notified. And also, if you like this video while you're watching as you go, don't forget to click that like button and also comment down below if you have questions and I will try my best to answer your questions. For this video, I made a small YouTube room tour and showed everything in here. But today, my main focus is to discuss about my techniques in lighting this video. Disclaimer that I am not a professional videographer or a DOP or a lighting director. I'm just a small and starting YouTuber. So this room is just a small room. It's only 9 square meter or 12, I believe. I am living in this room since I was 16. There's a lot of iterations or changes that happen in this room. Alright, so I optimized this room, especially the light things, um, for me to be able to make content fast because I would like to produce things fast. I have adjusted a lot of things in this room already. As you can see, I have uh, repositioned my room. So if you can see from this video, this is the dark video that I'm using before when I was trying to, you know, learn a YouTube video and like I was trying to experiment. And now I think I'm liking what I have right now. All right, so time to talk about the lights. I'm using the three point lighting technique that I have learned from Peter Wahlbeck, Peter Lindgren, Peter McKinnon. Every Peter is really good. Mati Hapoya and his brother Tepo. Tepo, if you're watching, shout out to you, mate. I invested in lightings for me to be able to, you know, make my videos look look good. The first light that I have is the key light, guys. So this one is the Godox SR60. The second light that I have is this a generic ring light that I bought from a local store here in the Philippines. The third one is my backlight. It's the Godox SL60 again. And I have some practical lights scattered everywhere. Actually, it's not everywhere. I intentionally positioned them to uh, add some look and in order for me to improve the look of the background and as well as to separate myself from the background so this is this light right here in the practical light it's just a lamp that's lighting my guitars I got that from a mall here in the Philippines in Manila uh, that one is the uh, Yi light I uh, got it from a, on, a, a local online store here in the Philippines as well. And the two blue lights, the teal one that you see below that TV is the Aperture MC. I got two of it. So right guys, I would like to turn on the lights one by one. In the next clip, you will be seeing darkness. Alright, so you can see that it's all, it's dark. The first light is the Godox SL60. This is the key light that I am using for a while now. I got that light in a local store here in the Philippines. So it's pretty cheap and affordable, especially when you're starting as a YouTuber like me. I don't really have a budget buying Aperture at the moment. Soon I will be and I'm planning to get an Amaran. But for now, Godox works fine for me, I guess. So that's the main key light that I have. The next light that I want to show you is my backlight. There you go. Yes, you can see. So the backlight that the backlight. <laughs> Back backlight. So the backlight that I'm using is Godox SL60 again. And the next light that I want to show you is my fill light. It's just a generic light that I bought from uh, one of the stores here in the Philippines. Alright, so the next light is that practical light over there. Yeah. Alright, so the next light I have right there. So that is a generic key light that I got from a local online store here in the Philippines. The next light that I have in this room are the Aperture MC lights that I got from BNH Photo. So yeah, I guess that's it. It's a small video about lighting. So if you like this video, please do subscribe to this channel like that. Click that bell notification icon in order for you to get notified whenever I upload a video. Smash that like button if you like this video and comment down below if you have questions, especially for my fil fellow fil fil blah. especially for my fellow Filipino friends. Wow, that's GF in a row. <laughs> Again, this is your boy Manu. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.